exploring the world of animals. I love segments like this. Back with us today is Noelle Tarrant, a licensed animal educator and owner of Zoozor. And who and what did you bring today? Well, today on the table we have Jake. And you know Jake because yes. you, you actually helped me do a show with him. And Jake is called a Burmese python. And they're one of the largest snakes in the world, but not the biggest, but he's, he's pretty big. What does um, he weigh? He's python. 80 pounds and he is 15 feet long, and he is actually 24 years old. And I can say that which, with, with perfect assurity because I've had him since the day he hatched out of his egg. Really? Yes, He's I your buddy. Him. He's my buddy. So a lot of people might be scared looking at this beast. Yes. Is he, I mean, are pythons are, can be very dangerous, but tell us about well, him. Well, you know, you're a, not in the jungles right. of, you know, uh, uh, Borneo or India or anything like here. that. Um, this is a captive-born animal. Um, I trust him probably more than any animal that I have. Really? Yes, I've been doing programs with him his whole life. Um, mm. That's one of the reasons why I love to show him for programs because, first of all, the it's reaction you get from the kids. You know, when we took him out at the Hi. Kids Expo, remember the reaction the kids get, that you get from people because he's just so big and they never saw yeah. anything like that. And, yeah. then, and then I also wanna, I want kids to be not afraid. I want them to just have a natural curiosity to learn about it, but have respect. They should have respect. So if they see an animal, in a snake in the wild, they should leave it alone. Right. But not to be like so scared that they're, you know. And we only have like 30 move. seconds, so I want to point okay. out can you find the animal in the bush here? <laughs> Hi. This, this is Leon, and he is called a chameleon. Look at him. And he changed colors beautiful? when you put him on he, here. Well, you know what? They, they camouflage. He'll just climb right on your arms. Oh. They camouflage. Hey. They don't change colors just. You know, if he, you would put him up against your black sweater, he's not going to turn black. Okay. They do that, they camouflage with the colors they would live in, in the, in the bushes or the, or the trees they would live in. He's from Madagascar. But he can also change for his mood swings or his mood changes. So if he were to get upset, he would turn black or, oh, or stressed out. But so he's happy. So green is happy. Yeah, he's hi, very happy. Buddy. He likes you. Aw, say hi to everyone at home. Hey, if you would like to learn more about Zuzor and Noelle's live animal programs, she does such an awesome job. Just log on to our web channel and click on news links. Ooh, look at that curly tail. We'll be back right after.